I first became aware of the counseling programs here at uh, Ashland Seminary back when I was in pastoral ministry. And I knew that God had called me to help people, but I found that the training that I had received was um, not adequate to really help people with issues like their marriages or parenting or things like depression, anxiety. And so I knew that I needed to get more training to be able to really help the people in my congregation out. Many people in the church know what they ought to do and what they ought to be and what they ought not do, but many of us just don't know how. And that's where we as trained counselors come into play, is that we help people do some of the things that they're wanting to do, they're wanting to become, and also helping them to get over some things that they're not wanting to do anymore. And so the training I got was just fantastic as a student. One of the things that came my way in the process was I didn't realize that I was going to be changed as a person coming to classes. I've been trained in traditional education where you go, you, you study, you read, you're tested, you write papers, and you earn a degree and in the process of that. You, you learn a lot of things, of course, but it was more in my head, not necessarily in my heart. Many years later, after being in clinical practice and going on for doctoral work myself, I came on faculty here at Ashland Seminary. And after being here a few years, uh, they asked me to direct the clinical mental health counseling program. And that's what I do now. And so it's always exciting to me when prospective students come in and I hear in their stories much of my story way back when I first came here. I'm able to share with them a little bit of my story and a little bit of what we do because we still emphasize the highest uh, quality of counselor education along with an emphasis on change of the person. Um, and when that comes together well, uh, our students graduate not only with excellent skills as professional clinical counselors, but also they're prepared for lives themselves.